Can we talk about it? You come out swinging. She was the villain. She was the bad guy. Yeah, he did some bad things. He cheated on her, but he left. She left him, all right? After she left him, anything he did was on him. You cannot be mad. And I paid you back. He paid her the money back. He paid her the money back with interest. All right, I know you had to sell your mother's house and you had to do all of this stuff, but I paid you back millions and you still after me? You still want part of my new life? You didn't believe in me. I love this movie. I just had to start getting into it. Can we just get into it? I don't even, nothing to talk about. Can we talk about this though? She was the villain, all right? She could have took the money and walk away. Why I never take the money and walk away? She could have found love, happiness, but no, she was obsessed with that chocolate man. She was obsessed with him. She couldn't let him go, especially when he blew up. She couldn't believe it. She felt like she was part of his success. She was, she was, all right? But he thanked her, he paid her back. What more you wanted from him? You knew, you knew the man he was. You chose to believe everybody else. You didn't think I was going to make it. You didn't believe in me. This is the prime example. Yo, This I think Drake wrote this movie because this is the prime example of what happens when a woman don't believe in you, you become successful. Can we talk about how she was villain? I don't want to see nothing else in the comment section except she was the villain. You right. Because she was the bad guy. That's She stalked them down on their honeymoon. How you chase your ex on your honeymoon? Sis, you had to get it together. All right? You had millions of dollars. This is what happens sometimes for women and men in general. Y'all get too obsessed in these relationships. Let people go. Learn to let people go. Now she's at the bottom of the river. But guess what? They doing a sequel. Can we talk about how they doing a sequel? How she's coming from the bottom of the map or wherever she was at? This movie is absolutely insane, and I love this movie. I went to see it in theaters when it came out. This was a cl classic, all right? A lot of people don't give this movie the props. This is my favorite Tyler Perry movie. I think this is the sum of all Tyler Perry's movies summed up in one movie. Got Taraji. You got Angry Black Woman. You got Angry Black Man that's a loser and could be better. Her husband's a loser, a bum whatever, set somewhere down south. She's probably a lawyer or a prosecutor or something. It's always the same job. Tyler Perry got four roles that he cast women as. But this movie is a classic because she's a villain. This is a classic horror story. She chased that man. She tried to ruin his life. He paid you back. I don't want if he, after he paid her back, I don't owe you nothing. Go find you a new man, new life. You want to find you a new pit man and do all that. Can we talk about my favorite? Can we talk about my favorite scene is when she drove through his trailer, but that's when she got, a wound got messed up.